what is going on guys it is your boy fly stewie back at it again with another one guys in today's video we're gonna go over some slp predictions and give you the reason why i think slp is going to 30 cents usd if you like more videos like this you want to see more make sure you hit that like that subscribe and that follow button guys did i say 30 cents usd gosh i need to I need to go back to the drawing board. Anyways, guys, I have three wild predictions about Axie Infinity that have massive SLP actual implications. And these are three of the things that I think is gonna happen in 2022, but I'm gonna go about it and talk about what I think might happen. So the first thing that I think is gonna happen is AXS in Axie Infinity um, it's gonna become way more important, way more use cases for it. The, one of the first things that I see happening is the way axes are bred will actually be changed, guys. So right now, if you go to Axie Infinity, boom, this is my backdoor office. If you want to breed someone right now, so let's click one of my favorite guys right here, this big, beautiful hunk of metal, this hunk of steel, and let's open up this right here. So if you want to breed someone right now, you go to breed and you have this nice little thing that says you need 1200 SLP and you also need one AXS to breed him. So, I mean, that makes sense. But what happens in all of these situations that we've seen where SLP has gone through this massive decline and AXS has gone through this massive run up, these dynamics actually change very frequently. So one of the things that might happen is they might start introduce like, if you see in Katana here, when you're farming, you kind of have pairs, right? You have AXS pairs with Weath. You also have S SLP with Weath. They might make like sort of like some SLP AXS sort of pair to kind of try to rationalize the um, actual breeding price so that it's relatively the same ratio that you're paying at the same time. Now they couldn't do this formally with a pair or they could start making more automated levers that say, hey, when AXS goes up to this price or when SLP drops to this price, then to breathe instead of using one AXS, it's gonna be 0.5 AXS. Instead of for a three bit actually costing 1200 SLP, maybe it costs us 2400 SLP. The actual implication of this is the SLP to USD um, ratio will go from 0 0.058 to USD to way higher as it costs more SLP to actually breed axes. If that makes sense, let me know with the like in the comments. Number two thing that I find very, very effective and what most likely will happen in the next season is I think that scholarships will depend more on AXS. By the way, guys, we're rocking on with Arison, um, Emerson in the building, uh, Alivera in the building, guys. Thanks for rocking out with us. Guys, scholarships are gonna depend way more on AXS. I think the reason that is is because they're definitely looking to switch to more of a competitive model, guys. As you know, some new changes come out and all these new changes are kind of affecting SLP earnings. Um, when you think about the new edition where you can't actually earn SLP under 800 MMR, when you think about the new edition that says, hey, gifted axes, have, they need to be in your account for more than 24 hours to earn SLP. Every sort of edition they're making is tr like hemorrhaging SLP earnings a bit. And I think what's gonna end up happening, maybe not in 2022, but 2023 is, you are gonna make most of your earnings actually from awards like these, this. So either from coming top 1,000, top 10,000, top 30,000, or maybe they're gonna have tournaments. Guys, AXS is gonna be more of the way things are gonna be paid out, I imagine. Um, I think they have a more of a limited supply of AXS, but I definitely seeing rewards for winning becoming more and probably earnings coming less. So. With that in mind, the way I'm thinking about my scholarship is how do I, one, enroll someone and then get them to a place where they perform um, and it can be one of those top 1,000 top people. So we have some stuff in store in my scholarship program. As you know, I run a scholarship of 20 scholars right now, guys. And I think we're gonna actually start preparing people to be super competitive in the meta. And number three of one of my big predictions that I think is coming up for Axie Infinity 
is I think Axie prices are going to absolutely skyrocket, guys. So if we go to the beautiful marketplace right now, and right here we're in the marketplace, so let's clear all our filters. And let's just look at the lowest price. Let's look at the floor price. Now, right now there's a breeding event that's going on. And you know, the first few axes maybe, let's see this, 0 0.025. Um, let's see if it's actually, you can buy it. So right now the floor price is 0 0.025, 0 0.023. So with the breeding event, as you know, people are breeding axes like crazy and it's causing the price of axes to go down. Um, which means it's an absolute buyer's market, but you have to ask yourself, right? If the value to create an Axie is one AXS plus 600 SLP, then at this point in time, you really have to think to yourself, you're like, the value of an Axie should be around 0 0.039 ETH. How is it going to 0 0.025 ETH? And again, if we go up to for sale, Right now, you can buy these floor axes for around $100. More meta axes are still around 0 0.05, 0 0.07, and really high competitive axes around 0.10. Um, and right now, the reason is because in Axe Infinity right now, as you know, there's still a high risk in the game. It's still not proven to be a really um you know for sure two years from now you can still make a lot of money with these axes but if you compare actual investing in axie to another thing like the stock market the stock market as you know the return for stocks is around seven percent per year now with an axie team of three people you're expected to make literally your money back within three to six months so realistically your percent return per year is around 200 percent compared to the stock market of 7 percent that's really really high and the reason why it's that high is because there's still a risk to it but what happens when axie infinity is not that risky anymore or not perceived to be that risky anymore then what's going to happen is eventually people will be fine with just earning a 10 percent return with axes and when that happens, that will only happen when the Axie prices are really, really high. I'm talking about 10 times and 20 times the price right now. So people will be willing to pay $1,000 for an Axie team to get a return of 20% per year. Um, so the equivalent price for that is literally like $10,000 an Axie or something like that. It's pretty crazy, pretty insane. But realistically, it's gonna be like land gameplay. The way that land gameplay is coming out in December and everyone's gonna be fine with playing on other people's land. I foresee an Axie World War. Most of the new users, just like it is today, are gonna be fine with renting other Axies because they'll be able to make money with it. So just imagine a game like Fortnite where you have a player base of 100 million active users a month and most of those are people that are renting other NFTs because they're able to make money off it. It's absolutely game changing. But those are my price predictions. Those are my predictions for 2022, 2023. I think they have massive implications to AXS going up in price, SLP going up in price. And this is reasons like this, this pressure with SLP and AXS becoming a pair or pair bonded for breeding with of course, AXS becoming more profitable not more just more profitable and being given out more for high performance in the game and of course with what i just talked about it actually prices going up 10x i think this all has very positive impacts for slp's price in the future but if you like videos like this and you want to see more make sure you hit that like button that subscribe button but we flight crew we gotta take off we will see you next time Peace.